perfect. Hey guys, what's up? I'm Ashna. Today I'm gonna be guest vlogging for EF. I am from Mumbai, India, but I study here in Southern California. And today I'm gonna be taking you to one of my favorite places in Costa Mesa. We're gonna go to the Anti Mall and you guys are gonna come with me. Uh, my friend is also coming along, so you guys will get to see her. But yeah, let's go. Guys, we're in Costa Mesa. It's basically like a open or outdoors mall. That's why it's called the anti-mall. I have like a picture from like last year when I came here, but it was in the nighttime and they have like lights at the top. It's so pretty in the nighttime. Oh, we have vegan donuts here. They have so many vegan donuts here, guys. It's called Town Donuts. Good Town Donuts. Oh yeah, wait, let me see. Yay, they have so many vegan donuts. Maybe we can like, come back later. Yeah. Okay. Okay guys, we're gonna go to Seabird's kitchen. <laughs> I'm just reading it here. Seabird's kitchen, um, it says it has vegan slash vegetarian options and I'm vegan, so we're gonna check that out. Guys, we're at Seabird's kitchen and it's all vegan. Like I walked in, I was like, I saw you guys have like vegan options, but um, he's like, yeah, it's literally all vegan, so. Hi, uh, good, do you wanna say hi? Hi, how are you? <laughs> Welcome to Seabird. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> okay, perfect. We got uh, two appetizers, grilled cheese and taquitos. Purple, purple taquitos. Purple taquitos. Made of purple taquitos. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay. It's vegan, but Paki said it tastes like normal grilled cheese. <laughs> One of the main reasons I moved to California is for the sunsets and sunrises. I know! It's literally for the freaking sky and the sunset and the sunrises because the sky doesn't look like this at all in Mumbai. Also guys, this place is really close to EF's big new LA campus which is going to be opening up in Costa Mesa and it's also close to EF's um, summer language school. Just throwing that out there. Basically, you run to this place called the camp. The camp has a lot of places that where you can eat at, you can shop. And then there's like thrifts, like a nail studio, um, tons of vegan options as well. We went to this cafe called Native Foods Cafe. They have like specials every month. This month's special was the tandoori chicken sandwich, which I thought was kind of funny because I mean, I'm Indian. Anyway, I ended up getting the grilled chicken burger. Obviously, chicken means vegan chicken. It's made out of soy and a side of mac and cheese. And my friend got, um, I don't know what this is. I think it's like a meatball sandwich sub with fries. And I put ketchup in my mac and cheese. Yeah, I am that person. Moving on, then we just walked around. We realized they also have a fitness studio inside the camp. We went to this store called pure i don't know pure pure i don't know how to say it but i'm just gonna say pure it was a boutique we just looked around we didn't really buy anything here Then we spotted this other place inside the camp. It was called the Second Street, and we decided to go inside because it was buy and sell secondhand clothes slash accessories for men and women. And we love thrift shopping because it's better for the environment. Secondhand stuff is always better for the environment than just like buying it firsthand. But it was so big, guys. It was literally so big. They had six stuff. My friend was again looking at jewelry because she loves jewelry. Um, and then I found this oversized like jacket from like someone who went to the military and it was so sick and i think i got it for like 33 dollars so um i just bought it ended up going to this place called Whittily cafe it was italian an italian cafe and we got some ice cream there i got a dark chocolate sorbet it was so good <laughs> okay i'm ending this video for real this time um but yeah, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up and also comment down below some places that I should visit that I haven't yet visited in Costa Mesa, some of your favorite places. Okay, bye guys.